Many labs prefer to review and edit files in the all-color browser. The electropharogram and report tables in the main analysis screen are automatically updated with edits made in the all-color browser view. If you would like to maximize the electropharograms of the data channels, use the color icon drop-down in the upper left corner to remove one or more of the dye channels, as in this example showing four of the five traces. Reporting options also include report tables and peak tables. Activate the allele report settings using the report icon in the upper right side of the main analysis screen. Select from the report style and other options to customize the report for your lab's preference. These report settings result in an allele report table listing the file name, loci, and allele calls. Use the Save icon to save the table as an XLS or text file. Another commonly used format is the peak table, where the analyst may select from a list of column headings to include in the report table, as seen in this report table example. After review and confirmation of the allele calls, activate the Mixture Analysis screen from the Application drop-down and select Mixture Analysis. In the upper left side of the screen, we see the files grouped in a file name tree dependent on whether they have the characteristics of a single contributor, two contributor, or three or more contributors. The automated calculations for files with three or more contributors include PI, PE, CPI, CPE, and RMNE. In this example, all of the allele calls of the single source file MX05 case2 underscore victim are included in the file MX case2 evidence. So the single source file is listed twice in the file name tree. Under the one contributor file, along with the positive control, and indented under the MX05 case2 evidence file. The single source file is also listed under the contributor 1 at the bottom of the screen. Since the peak ratios are approximately 1 to 3 or less, the file is also identified as the minor contributor. If the peak ratios were approximately 1 to 1, it would just be listed as a contributor, not major or minor. Select the appropriate parameters using the upper left icon. Choose from peak height or area and use the default settings or customize each of the parameters. In order to calculate PI, PE, and likelihood ratio, it is necessary to select the appropriate allele frequency table from the drop-down list. When the allele frequency table is selected, the mixture calculations are displayed in the right side of the screen. Published guidelines for mixture analysis recommend viewing all possible allele combinations. These are displayed in the middle report table. The red font cells are allele combinations that do not agree with the mixture parameter selected. To view only the black font or combinations that are in agreement with all of the mixture parameters, click on the far right icon. In this particular case, the victim single source file is the minor contributor. There is not a reference file for the perpetrator or the mi major contributor. However, there is a unique deduced genotype for the major contributor for all loci. To submit this deduced major contributor genotype to the database, select the lower right icon and choose Submit Major. Click on the icon to the left to search the database for matches to the deduced major contributor. The results are displayed in the Contributor 2 drop-down menu. The search located the deduced file MX05 case2 evidence underscore major and one single source file that was previously loaded to the database individual XYZ.
When selected as contested, the likelihood ratio that another random person from the population contributed this genotype to the mixture is calculated and displayed in the far right column of the result table. In this case, 1 out of 1.37 times 10 to the 24. Comments may be typed in the lower right box. These are automatically saved when the table is saved or copy and pasted into a report table and comments by right-clicking on the table and select Copy. This provides a complete record of the analysis all in one location. If the single source sample you wish to export in CODIS format is in the current project, activate the CODIS export option from the icon in the application's drop-down of the main analysis screen as we did in the introductory GeneMarker HID webinar. If the file to be exported in CODIS format is in the Relationship Testing Database, as in the previous slide case with individual XYZ, return to the Main Analysis screen, select Applications and Relationship Testing. In the Relationship Testing screen, select Database and Edit Database. Select the file and then the CODIS export icon. This easy-to-use interface has fields to record the user ID, source and destination ORI, and saves the files in CODIS-compatible format. Select the PCR kit, the specimen category, and the source identified verification from the drop-down menus, then save with the disk icon at the lower right. Thank you for participating in the Mixture Analysis GeneMarker HID webinar. The Mixture Analysis Assistant was developed using the recommendations of the DNA Commission of the International Society of Forensic Genetics. It automates repetitive calculations, including probability of inclusion, probability of exclusion, and likelihood ratios, and has a database search capability. The linked user manual is available at the Help drop-down menu and includes examples of each mixture analysis equation. GeneMarker HID Validated Concordant Human Identity Software provides accurate, rapid analysis of forensic STR data with quality flagging, size calibration checks, and automated control concordances. The program is compatible with all major capillary electrophoresis file types and human identity PCR kits. The user management provides an audit trail of all actions and a variety of options for access rights. The linked navigation and intuitive interface decrease user fatigue and increase time savings. Final results may be reported in a variety of formats, including allele and peak tables and CODIS format. Thank you for your interest in GeneMarker HID Human Identity Software. For more information or to download a free 30-day trial, go to www.softgenetics.com or send us an email at info at softgenetics.com.